Yo, what's up everybody? Welcome to my channel with a brand new video and in this video I'm gonna show you how to fix the low GPU usage while you gaming. Guys, a lot of people have a good GPU but still they are getting less FPS because of the low GPU usage in the games. So in this video I'm gonna show you some possible fixes for fixing this issue and increasing the performance of your game on your PC. So guys, let's start over this video. So guys, first of all, you need to download some softwares on your PC. Link in the description below of this video so you need to open the link from descriptions and that will take you here onto this website and guys you need to download this fix low gpu usage while gaming pack for 2022 and guys if you not find this pack here so you need to go into the search icon and search for the low gpu usage and once you search this thing so guys here you will got uh, this kind of post here so you need to click here on this post scroll down and here is this two download button so guys download these two soft which is the display driver uninstaller and the msa after burner you need to download this both software once you download the software so guys here you will go to this kind of the zip file so first of all you need to guys open up the zip file and guys drag out this both folder here on your desktop from the zip file once you got this so guys double click here on this active file and click on the extract here button and you will get this uh, folder here on your desktop now you need to open up this folder and here is the exe file for the display driver uninstaller so guys first of all you need to uninstall the previous or the old driver of your gpu then we are gonna install the new one and then we will guys do some and other tweaks for fixing over this low gpu usage issue so guys now click here on this ok button and now click close again click ok and guys now what you need to do now you need to guys delete your old driver so how to do it so first of all go for this select device type and set it on to gpu now select out your uh, graphics card model like i have the nvidia so i will go with the nvidia and now click on to the clean and the restart and this is the highly recommended and guys once you do this thing guys this will uninstall your driver of your gpu i have not guys doing this because this is also very simple you need to click on this uninstall and restart and this will clean your driver and then restart your pc one time once you restart your pc now you need to guys follow uh, the next step you need to open up your browser and go straight toward the website of the nvidia or the amd for downloading the driver for the nvidia website you need to go onto the nvidia.com and here you will find out this driver section go inside it select out your product type or your gpu model like i have the g4 3650 super so this will guys automatically detect this one but if you're not so you need to manually select from this list so once you do it now for the amd users you need to go on to the amd drivers website open up this first link now scroll down find out your gpu model for example if i have a, a rx 570 so you need to go into this graphic sections go for the rx 500 series so uh, here is this 500 series for the GPU So here is the GPU series for the Radeon 500 series You need to select the uh, 500 and download the driver for your GPU by clicking on the submit button And download for Windows 10 or Windows 11 whatever guys you have Once you download and install the driver on your PC guys Now you need to go for the next step And this is about the MSI after burner We are not gonna guys uh, overclock our gpu because this is harmful for some pcs so you need to open up this zip file double click here and simply install this software on your pc once you double click here you will go to this window click ok next i agree the term of the license agreements click next and click install the software so guys once you install the msa afterburner on your pc you will get this kind of interface on your pc of the software so what you need to guys change here into the software you need to go straight toward this temperature limit sections and guys set this temperature limit on to the maximum which is available according to your gpu so guys for me it is like 87 percent so i just set it on to the uh, maximum one and also automatically the power limit also increase so guys this is the reason therefore you are getting the low gpu usage on your game so guys once you do this thing now you need to simply uh, minimize the software and keep it running whenever guys you play any game and in which game guys you are getting the low gpu usage issue so what's once you do it now i'm gonna show you some window settings for increasing the gpu usage or increasing your fps so you need to right click here on your desktop go straight towards the display settings scroll down towards this graphic settings now go for this option which is the hardware accelerated gpu scheduling so turn it on if you don't have this option because uh, probably most of the time amd 
users not have this option so guys don't worry you leave this option but if you have this one so make sure to turn it on now go towards this browse sections and add here your all the games like fortnite gta5 warzone or any other game guys in which you are getting the low gp usage issue like for example i have already added here my fortnite now i will go to where my valorant so i will go into this live sections and here is my valorant xv file click on this add button go for this option and set it on the high performance and if i was getting the issue in my valorant or the fortnite or any game i need to add here then go into this option and set it on the high performance for fixing my this issue so once you do it now you need to close out your this folder now guys right click here again go straight to where your nvidia control panel or your amd control panel and there you will find out an option of the power management of your gpu so you need to go straight to where the settings of your gpu and there you will find out an option uh, similar like the power management mode so you need to set it always on the platform maximum performance now hit apply the option you will get after changing the settings and guys close out the software now one time restart your pc then launch your fortnite and guys don't forget to turn on the msi afterburner in your background before launching that game or any software in which you are in which you are getting the issue so i hope so guys this video really helped you to guys fixing your this issue so please make sure to subscribe turn on the bell notification leave a like on this video and leave your opinion about this video so till at the next video peace out